11 days since impact. If I can just find four more parts, the dolphin will be fully rebuilt. But time has grown short. I must not flag in my search. Even if I can't recover every piece, I will not give up. Surely some of those parts aren't absolutely necessary. I can almost see my smiling family. Hey Embers, welcome back to the corner. My name is Gygus. And I'm Heron, and welcome back to Pikmin. This is the finale! Woo! Yay! Finally ready to be done with this game. <laughs> yeah, you sounded like you were going to say something else about the game. <laughs> I I could have added a couple words in there as well. So. <laughs> Violent string of swears. <laughs> you know I am ready to cause mass Pikmin genocide. Let's go. <laughs> Jeez. I don't know if you can say that on YouTube. <laughs> Even if they're like... I specified Pikmin. It's fine. Okay. If this video gets flagged, you'll understand why. <laughs> Imagine it not being for what I said. Some random other thing in the video. Mm -hmm. Yay. All right, we'll do your run because my run sucked. I told you it was probably a decent idea. You might want to flower up. Actually, yeah, that's probably a good idea. All right. Uh, wild grass. You got wild grass there. You also got wild grass over there. And you've got stones. You've got multiple options. How do you feel about multiple options? Actually, are you one of the person, uh, one of the, one of the persons, one of the type of, types of people, I can speak words, that prefers, um, having, like, a bunch and bunch and bunch of different choices, or, um, or, like, a very, very few amount? I would like, I, I tend to like a few amount because it's easier to decide what, uh, what to do. You see, that's kind of my thought process with it, it's just like, because if you have too many options, you don't know what to do. I don't know where you, you went said, that way. You said there's bomb rocks over here. Not over there. Well, I have to get through. Okay. I was just like, I thought you were talking about the direction you were going. There was like, water the other way. Uh, okay. So go to where the captain's seat is. Um, Three. right over there. Right over there. You saw them. They exist. They are here. They do exist. Mythical, mythical bomb rocks. Funnily enough, um, you don't use bomb rocks in Pikmin 2. They are specifically a trap. Yes, you heard me right. They are a trap. Interesting. Um, in multiple of the dungeons that you'll encounter, um, there are... Well, those oh, are okay. dead. They're dead. Okay, then, Pikmin. I didn't realize I could even do that, but... Let's <laughs> throw Pikmin over the wall? Oh, it survived! They survived! I'm a survivor. Come here. Press buttons. Gotta yep. go back. Accidentally activates bull bear. Bull bear. Bull bear borb. Bull bear borb. Bull bear borb. All right, Pikmin, Wait, come on. on. Can I get Can I get through this without screwing this up? The bear bubble blacks. There we go. The bear bubble blacks. The bear bubble blacks. What is a Bavera Bulba Blacks? <laughs> Just Explain, <a> Heron. <laughs> Explain what that is. I I got nothing. No, it's no. You've committed the, to this now. What is um, it? It's a, it's a mythical creature in in Pikmin. It's actually it's a legendary Pokemon. Uh, <laughs> a Pokemon in Pikmin. A Pokemon in Pikmin. Yep, you can catch it. And you can uh, force it to defend your well, <laughs> like <laughs> kind of like uh, like Pikmin and also Pokemon. <laughs> I was gonna say uh, the the dog. Oh, what, Ochi? Me. Ochi, yes. Except Ochi isn't bent to your will. He just chooses because he's a loyal pup and he's amazing. Unless you're playing multiplayer, Even and then Ochi has a mind of his own. Yep. Yeah, I'm fun. Yeah. Yay. Come here. No. We a blow up wall. You have time. Okay. You don't have much time, but you have time. <laughs> Go over here. Alright, they're gonna they're gonna do things. Flywog. Just ignore. Just ignore. One, two, three, four, five, six. So two sets of three and you should be fine. Boom. Okay, that's your yeah. My yellow. I'm gonna leave them here. Okay, that works. You bait the wallywogs. 
I don't need those Pikmin anymore, so I literally could care less what they do. Wow. All right, come on, Blues. You have a job to do. I was literally just about to say, I hope all of your Blues get stuck under the bridge. <laughs> and they did! <laughs> We're wasting time. Actually, yes, it, it's wasting time for you. Yeah, which I'm mad about. Stop wasting time. Blame Pikmin AI. That's you. It's your fault. You are controlling them. You just killed a bunch of Pikmin. Not as much as you would think, though. You just killed 20 Pikmin in one fell swoop. It's fine. Spam, 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 spam. If you want to know an in-depth detail guide about how to fight this boss, I don't know why you would. But we talk about it in day... Part 3? Probably. No. Part... Maybe it is part 3. No, 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 it's not. It's part 2. No? Yeah, it's part 3. I don't know. That's one of the parts of Pikmin. For some reason, you guys like this shit series apparently which is fine right, ignore them ignore them ignore them good sir okay i'll go the other way i'm just trying to prep you for for bulborb in <laughs> interceptor uh, uh, Bul actually bulbear i can use these come here pikman bulbear interception Let's go. what are you doing i'm going to get the other part oh, okay. here, somewhere. yeah that's right somewhere mm -hmm. it's right oh, there it's right there in the corner in the corner good sir it's hiding in the corner. It's hiding in plain sight. It doesn't like you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I don't know where the other Pikmin went. They just separated. Uh, oh, that's where. They decided to fight Wallywog. On their own accord. I did not send them to their deaths. Alright, just, just ditch. Just, just ditch. Yay! They survived somehow. I can't skip. Nope. Two more to go. We're almost done. Go build bridge. Cap. Doing actually really good on time. You see, you say that, and then I suddenly don't have any time to fight the Smoky Proc. <laughs> it's fine. You can handle it. I can handle it? You can handle it. What does tandle mean? Think of the uh, tandem handling. Like a tandem bike? So, so like, working on a group project? Yeah, tandling. Okay, guy, guess. I don't know. You questioned me about it. I gave you an answer. And I should have shut my mouth. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Alright, that's good. Ah, uh, Pikmin. Me. Stupid Wallywog. That Wallywog is going to hook onto those guys. Probably. I called it. Bye, Pikmin. Oh nope, it's gonna get it's gonna get caught on the bridge. Nope, it's gonna it's gonna kill them all. Bye, Pikmin. I don't know what happened to the Wallywog. It doesn't exist over there. No. Nope. <laughs> it it disappeared. It nope, it, it's over there. I can see it. Oh. I found the gluon drive. <laughs> Did you though, Ball Balamar? Balamar? Balamar. <laughs> it's the ball equivalent of Balamar. Balamar. Yay. Interrupted cow. Moo! I haven't heard that since, like, elementary <laughs> school. <laughs> Alright, I guess I should deal with them. Or you lose all my blues. I'm gonna kill all my Pikmin, good sir. We have more. They are disposable. See, that's... Okay. They're living creatures, Gygus. They are a bunch of ones and zeros. They are living creatures in this world. Would you like to have a pet Pikmin? They would be microscopic. No, I would not. <laughs> if they are anything like these, no. <laughs> it's like the... Uh, I will make them burn. Jeez. Gygus is the kid that, uh, that held a magnifying glass up to ants and watched them burn. I've tried that, actually. I can confirm I've actually tried that, but I've failed. <laughs> I feel like every kid at one point has actually tried that, though. I, nope. I can uh, I can say I never did that. Bad. Were you ever stung by a wasp or a bee? I was. I, I have. My family says I was. I don't have any recollection of being. <laughs> of being? Yeah. That was a pun. It was an unintentional pun. But I'm happy nonetheless, because puns are hilarious. 
All right, we're gonna we're just gonna send all these Pikmin over. Just walk through the nectar. Yep. Walk, 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 walk. You're gonna need these later, so. Thank you. Come here. You do not need that. Uh. Oh, it's the other side. The other side that's having problems. Mm-hmm. Which is surprising because. This side was attacked by a Wallywog. <laughs> and it still finished its job. So what does that say about you, Pikmin? What does that say about you? I don't know. I put equal amount on this side. It's, um, so bridges are, they don't work the way you think they do. They don't build faster the more Pikmin you have on it. There's a set threshold. I just don't remember what the thresholds are. Which is why I just swarm them whenever I'm doing things. Alright. Weird, right? All right, Pikmin. It's gonna. S I wonder what's gonna happen to the to the Wally Wob, a uh, Wally Hop, Wally Hop. Yeah, cause that's stupid. Wally Wog. It's a Wally. Wog. It is a Wally, a Wally Wog. And it's so stupid that they changed the name of it. I don't know why they did. Finally, this Wally Wog is funny. All right, let's swarm him. Come here, Pikmin. Well, they figured out what happened to the Wally Wog carcass. It. It decided to be a glitchy mess. <laughs> Let's see if it'll glitch us in a good way, and it will just send the ship part to the base. It'll it'll actually act like a Wallywog and send all the Pikmin flying <laughs> across the map. Well, uh, Wallywogs don't uh, send Pikmin flying. It'll act like a puffy blowhog. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that! <laughs> Oh, it's moving! There it goes. It's moving! Can, can I actually, like... No, you can't, because it's underground. <laughs> nope. All right. Next click! That, that is The funny. Pikmin are stuck because the... of it. Okay. <laughs> okay, buddy. It's gonna be like that, uh... Like a cartoon. Like, it's, like, phasing through an object. Mm -hmm. That is exactly what's happening. Genuine, I'm not giving you any ideas. I am not giving okay. any ideas. Great. <laughs> now I have to fight the smoky pro. I don't have enough time to fight it. I gave you, I gave you time. I have less than, I have less than two minutes. I have a little over two minutes. Well, Pikmin are ready to go. So, <sighs> good luck. All right, give me, give me shots. All right, it is Heron's turn. He's gonna try to fight this now. All right, this boss I do believe is I uh, does not spawn, uh, and it doesn't exist past the day twelve. So this is kind of our last day to fight it. I could be wrong about that. Please correct me in the comments. Uh, I can actually look that up right now. Yeah, why not? Let's do that. Speak words, guy. I guess. May as well. All right, let's see here. Uh, do 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 I don't think I activated it. I did. Okay, we're fine. The only way to encounter it is to visit its egg in the distant spring on or before the 15th day. So it is so it's day 15. Okay, so we've got another three days that we can work with here. But I want to try to fight this thing now because, yes, this is the hardest boss in Pikmin, but it goes it gives a pretty decent reward. It gives you a golden seed that is worth 100 Pikmin. Yep. So it's completely optional to do. It is not any way, shape, or form uh, necessary for 100%. Yep. Um, but how, how do you fight this thing? Well, you want to wait for it to, to do its summon call. Summon call? It's summon call. And then you're going to attack its face. Because if you go past its face or, um, or touch that black stuff that it's spewing out behind there, um, yeah, it, uh... It will kill you instantly. That is poison. It's the only instance of poison in Pikmin 1, and it sucks. Yep. I will try my best to finish this in time. I probably won't. Just spam it. I can't. Because it might start moving. If it starts moving, then... Then all my Pikmin will die. Yeah, it's fine. I care about lives of Pikmin, unlike Gygas. All right, but this exists. Uh, it's really not that big of a boss fight, and you've already seen everything that it can do. Um, but that golden seed, it holds three Pikmin. It's similar to a pearl. It's just more valuable. Yep. That's really it. All righty. Gygus. Yep. 
that that's all that's all Heron's gonna do today. Yep. Because you didn't give me enough time to find it. I I actually think I did pretty good with the pathing. You did. So there there was nothing I could have really done about that. Yeah, you could have. But it's fine. You still managed to complete the goal. Yep. So this is a fun little thing. Um, once you get 29 parts, you unlock the final trial. The final trial, um, the stars in the background over there, uh, once you, only when you initially unlock it, do those exist. So if you tried to go into like Forest Naval or anything like that, um, after seeing uh, uh, after seeing it originally, then uh, then they'll just disappear and it's kind of sad. Yep. But it's supposed to be epic because this is the final trial. Yep. So this is kind of cool. It's the, um, there's only one ship part, um, and it's in the carcass of the, uh, of the final boss. Check. So 40, so you want I 80. need 80. Yep. 80 blues. So blues have one thing they have to do today, and it's build bridges. Yep. Seriously, that's it. And I get 10 reds. And 10 yellers. 10 yellows. Bunch of candy pop buds over there if you, in case you don't have enough Pikmin um, of a specific color, because we're going to be using largely reds and uh, yellows to fight this boss. Okay. All right, so. And what I'm going to do now so, is separate. Yep. Divide and conquer. Oh, that's lovely. Thanks, Pikmin. Hang on, let's okay, try this again. Time. Let's try this again. There, there you go. go. Much better. All right. They pleased you once. Now I throw... 40. 40. 40. 240. Chew. Chew, chew. Chew, 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 chew. Actually, I might be going now. I can't go. Nope. That's fine. Alrighty, do things. All right. Things and doing that. Dozen things. I'll grab the reds. Alrighty. Let's see. Can Gygus do this again? This again? Is... This is my first try. No, 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 no. This is the same um, thing that you had to do with the uh, repair type bolts in the last episode of Big oh. So, but the nice thing is there's enough of a guard this time that you <laughs> that you should be able to do this significantly easier. Alright, so if you just do that and then press X. Yep, they're good. Alright. They're going to start moving. Okay, and now... We go get bombs. Yay. Bombs are important. I promise. Come. Pressing buttons, pressing buttons, pressing buttons. All right, let's go, Pikmin. You missed one. I am aware. Okay. And throw. Alrighty. Hey, I'm actually doing better than the attempt that you showed me. Alrighty, get... Well, you, you saw it. I, I, it was the first time I played that in a little bit, but... Okay. Get ready to watch Magic. Yep. Magic Pikmin. <laughs> if I can if I can do this right. <laughs> so all, you can all, all visibly see that there are no bomb rocks except for the one that's outside of the boot. Let's see what happens. Lots of them. <laughs> Lots of me. Lots of me. I haven't, I haven't seen that <laughs> episode in forever. That's like one of my favorite episodes because I'm actually a really big fan of zombie. You're not going to get any more. I'm actually a really big fan of really stupid zombie movies um, and just zombie movies in general because they're just funny. It's it's kind of my uh, my mom's and me uh, guilty pleasure. Whatever we're all together, we watch zombie movies and they're freaking hilarious. <laughs> I. What is your favorite like comedy zombie movie? Oh, 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 okay. I will never watch this movie again. Uh, okay, no, 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 no. I have a better... Uh, I, I unphrased the question. That makes sense. <laughs> uh, now, my favorite zombie movie is, in fact, Zombieland. Zombieland and Zombieland 2 are fantastic movies, and I love them. So you want 30, and then... Um, remember, there's a bunch of blues that you still gotta go get. So if you max out your reds, and then... I'm just getting them while I'm here. Yeah. I'm trying to be time efficient. Yep, you should still have plenty of time to do things. Okay, so one, two. But yeah, Zombie Land. I love Zombie Land. Uh, I my favorite zombie comedy movie is Shaun of the Dead. Shaun of the Dead is is pretty good. You're good. All right, ditch your ditch your Pikmin, grab your blues, and go ham. Okay. Go ham. What's your favorite kind of like preparation of ham? Uh. uh... 
Because my uh, my grandpa, my great grandpa, um, he used to, um, to cook ham for us every time we had a family gathering, and he would soak it in pineapples. Oh, so like cured ham. Uh huh. And it was so freaking delicious. Um, it, it got to the point where like there were these very very rich sweet chunks of ham at the bottom of it that kind of melted off the bone a little bit. It tasted so freaking good. I like honey glazed ham. It's like if you get a crust on it, it's actually really good. Mm -hmm. I can agree with that. Thirty. And then max out your raids. Not what I wanted to do. That's fine. fine. You really don't need like 50 billion and a half yellows. Um, honestly, you can probably get this done in 10, but it's better to have a surplus. Yep. Um, because we're gonna be sacrificing yellows for this boss fight. It um, it's the only way I know how to fight the uh, the final boss here. Um, easily. Easily. So yeah, don't forget your reds that are that are on the box. Box Pikmin. Box Pikmin. All right, so then Pikmin five. Box, box Pikmin. Pikmin. What would a box Pikmin entail? Like, what what would their skill Maybe set be? Maybe it can store things. Ooh, that could be interesting. I only threw one. <laughs> I only threw one bomb rock. Okay. I don't understand. Maybe these are specialty grade uh, spider um, spider walls. Perhaps that are just very very badly broken. Let's see. Let's. Yep. Huh. Only one. Usually it takes two. Weird. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna do some magic tricks. Yeah, more magic tricks. Actually, and you then... can probably just ditch your reds. Yeah. <laughs> magic! Whee! And magically. They're gonna ditch everything. <laughs> yeah, that. Duplication that's... glitch! <laughs> it's, it's, it's not... <laughs> yeah, I don't know why that happens. I think you got all the ones in there. I think it's just the ones outside now. But that's fine, because there's another boot over there if you want it. Nope. Yeah, I think you're chilling, actually. I don't think you need to get any more. All right, well. So grab your heads. Actually, you just want to grab one. Actually, yeah. All right, come here. Actually, grab, um, grab, a, grab Bomb Rock. That'll be the best way to handle this. Love that. Thanks. There's another Pikmin just kind of chilling over at the gate. There we go. Alrighty, and kaboom! Wait. No? Okay. It might go boom. It went boom! It's okay, Pikmin. It's Alrighty. okay. This is the Emperor Bull Blacks, the final boss of Pikmin 1! And how do you fight it? Rinse and repeat. Seriously. Um. He goes poof. He goes poof because. And then Bomarok... I throw Pikmin out of space. Yep, and this is just rinse and repeat. He has a couple of other attacks, but that's really it. But you wanna. Uh, he will stop. That is instant death. He will stick his tongue out and try to eat a bunch of Pikmin. That is also instant death. Uh, everything about this boss is basically instant death. So enjoy. Just do one. Thank you. Yep, so just let it meander a little bit. You, the big thing you want to watch here is you want to watch his mouth. If he is drooling, it means that he's hungry and he will uh, use his tongue attack. If he's not drooling, he will do a different attack, which is very, very deadly. Spam the Pikmin. Come on, come on, that's enough. I don't know what that spring sound effect was, but okay. I don't know. Okay. Alrighty, and hey. we, we rinse and repeat. I can just get one, thank you. There you go. Happy birthday. We Press buttons. Uh, I canceled out the Pikmin. It canceled out. You're going to lose all your reds. I wanted it cancel out my Pikmin. Um, because it threw the bomb in its mouth instead of being swallowed by it. You threw it too early, essentially. So don't throw the Pikmin. Just ditch it. Bye, or, or, Pikmin. I enjoy this boss fight. I get to sacrifice Pikmin and watch things explode. You're like a, you're like a child. I am a child. I'm an adult child, and I will accept that. Uh, expired children, I believe, is the term. <laughs> you're an expired child. No, that's the thing about guys. We just grow old. We don't. We don't age. That. Or we don't. We don't. Grow, <laughs> we don't grow up. We just age. <laughs> That, that's better. That's a better way. <laughs> we don't. What did you say? <laughs> I don't know. 
We don't. We don't. We don't, we don't grow up. We just. That's yeah. what you meant to say, but yeah. you said it backwards. It was just like, <laughs> good job, guy. Guess you screwed up right. everything. It's gonna bounce. Wait. And it's gonna bounce. Or it's gonna be disinterested. Bounce. Come on. Eat your eat your dinner. Eat your dinner. You want to try to make it close because you're gonna have not a whole lot of time. Yeah, button press. It's fine. I think I have a t enough time. Yeah, you should. Yeah, do fangs. By the way, this is my first time ever fighting this thing. Yeah, you've never. You've I've never fought this before. Fun fact: everything we've done in the distant spring, like uh, my run forward, is completely. Can I, can I just? No, I might. Not. I might be able to just attack him. But yeah, no. Everything from yeah, um, I, my run just... of the distant spring forward. I, might, I know. I might just be able to do this and finish him off. You're just killing a bunch. I did. I did. I got him. Well, there you go. Yay! Secret safe. The last. Funnily enough, not um. Funnily enough, the op an optional ship part. I uh, that is a secret save. It exists. I'll tell you 100% the game, but it is optional. Yep. So that's it. We we've we've 100% the game. Yep. And we will get the best ending. And we will see you shortly to show you off the other endings after we finish it. Yippee! Yeah. I'm just gonna put the rest of my thing in here. Yellow. Slacker, I ought to throw you in the water. Do it, do it, do it. <laughs> Wrong Pikmin. There you go. Unnecessary casualties. His brothers had to pay for his crime. Isn't that a war crime? Maybe. I'm wanted in all 50 states. That's a statement. And also impressive. I don't think there's this, unless it's like a nationwide manhunt. I don't think there's that's ever been a thing. <laughs> I could be wrong about that. No, yeah, unless it's a, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's treason. Yeah. Yay! Looking shiny stuff and things. Time to go. Ending. Bye, Pikmin. I will never have to see you again. That's a lie. You will. Yeah. Guess. Bye, Pikmin. They they do a little little wheel with their 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 leaves. Little wheel leaves. All right. Can I can I leave now? I want to get off this planet. No, you cannot. My comfy seat. Fully equipped dolphin. That's Let's go. Such a weird statement. And the Pikmin realize they don't need a captain. They can survive on their own. Attack. They can actually survive the night now. Yay. Can they though? Can they really? I mean, kind of, sort of. Kind of, sort of doing things. Alrighty, let's reflect. As we see a bunch of Pikmin onions that will never be used. Green is not a thing. Magenta is a thing. Light orange, blue. Orange is not a thing. Light blue is not a... Light blue could be a thing. Ice... ice mm -hmm. Yeah, it mm -hmm. is a thing. Ice Pikmin. Yeah, that's right. Light blue is a thing. Green doesn't exist. Black onion. Well, yes and no. If, if you wanted to consider it, but... They, they grow in the ground, not not in an onion. Yeah. Glow, glow Pikmin. Glow Pikmin, and then uh, there's no such thing as a black onion because rock Pikmin are gray. Yeah. <laughs> Granite Pikmin. Charcoal Pikmin. Flint Pikmin, if you will. That could be an interesting Pikmin. Right? Yay! It just combusts. Actually, that would be interesting. Like a flammable Pikmin that doesn't die. Fire. Well, yeah, but you, like one that actually catches on fire. <laughs> that would be cool, right? Alrighty, so this is my uh, my third Lord. my third best run on this. But yeah, as you can see, those blue ship parts in the bottom right corner are your optional ship parts. You got the Nova Blaster from the Forest of Hope, Space Float, and uh, from the 
uh, Force Naval, Massage Machine, and UV Lamp from the Distant Spring, and the Secret Safe from the Final Trial. Everything else is necessary to get the standard, um, normal basic ending of Pikmin. Which we'll be showing you... Now. Alrighty, we decided to show off another thing that we, uh... <laughs> Because <laughs> uh, this is what we did for Gaius' therapy session, basically. <laughs> yep. Because this is the only way that we're going to be able to actually progress the day. Yeah, because unfortunately, once you get to day 29, it doesn't let you go to sunset. Which sucks. But it is what it is. No, no one survived! This just cause a mass extinction to end the day. Yep. Let's show you guys what happens when all of your Pikmin die. They'll die to fire and water. <laughs> and that's all of them. That's game. Pikmin extinction. Yep. It will automatically end the day. Time to go home with no Pikmin. And only missing one ship part. Pikmin survived! Somehow. We caused a Pikmin extinction, but not really. Nope. Because the Onion actually has infinite Pikmin. Seriously, if you start the next day after causing a Pikmin extinction, each of your onions separately spawn one type of Pikmin, so you can start rebuilding your population. So the only way to actually lose this game is to max out your counter for days. Yep. And here's the normal ending. Yep. That's it. Pretty much same thing. Just no, uh... Just no parade of onions that don't exist. Or, uh... Pikmin deciding to fight back. Or Pinwheel Pikmin. <laughs> That's really it. So, it says goodbye to PNF 404. Yep. And, and we will see you in the bad ending. Hang on, momentarily. There's, no, there's nothing different. Don't know, for sure. It's been a little while since I've seen things. So, it should just start the credits. Yep, okay. That's it. Okay. I just spent the last like 10 minutes skipping through days. These are my tutorial Pikmin on a different file. Yay. So much fun. Finally getting done with this. Pikmin extinction. That was significantly easier. But this is what happens whenever you get the bad ending. Yep. It looks eerily similar to the normal ending, except when we try to take off, we only have reds because we never discovered the blue or the yellow. Bye, Pikmin. Bye-bye. We will be back very shortly. Momentarily. Guys... Do, 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 do. I don't think that's how you pilot a rocket ship. Nope. As Olimar finds out the hard way. Heck. My worst run of Pikmin ever. <laughs> I got one ship burnt. <laughs> and it was the engine. And this is what happens. I love that it's only red Pikmin because I never actually discovered the yellow or the blue ones in, my, in this yeah. file. That's funny. I actually really like that detail. Away Olimar goes. Becoming, Becoming a seed. Becoming a leafling. What is a leafling, you may ask? Well, hop on over to Pikmin 4 and find out. Even though I'm pretty sure that's not how it went. But. No, it is. It was even confirmed. In-game, good sir. So. 
Good ending and bad ending are both canon. Well, no, uh, Pikmin 4 kind of retconned everything. So, <laughs> um, I do want to show this off real quickly. Uh, this is the file select screen, but um, this is challenge mode. It's basically nothing. The whole goal is to uh, is to go to each of the five levels and to sprout as many Pikmin as possible. There are enemies, other things like that. It's basically... I have time for this. It's basically... I'm not doing a full run, buddy. Calm down. But yeah, it'll spawn you with Pikmin just around. Your whole goal is to get as many as possible. Yeah, that's really it. So, through this mode, you'll find things that normally wouldn't be there. For example, this dwarf bull board wouldn't be here. Um, you wouldn't normally have anything over here. This is actually kind of cool because this is a section of the map we never went to. <laughs> but, yeah, it really, uh, you, you can do this with whatever level. It's just kind of a fun little mini challenge that you'll unlock after beating the game. Um, actually, I think the HD remake, yeah, look, there's a Wally Wally gear. <laughs> I think the HD remake actually makes it so that you just have it unlocked from the get-go. But in the original GameCube and um, uh, and Wii versions of this game, uh, you do have to beat the game originally to unlock it. But yeah, that's basically it. So, well, this has been Pikmin. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, those uh, optional endings or those other alternate endings of Pikmin. <laughs> yep, uh, they they are kind of funny. Um, and unfortunately, we are going to have to go off screen and, uh, <laughs> and create some files necessary to make those, but it's fine. Yeah, it'll only take us like five minutes. Yeah, it's just tedious and annoying, but it's fine because we're chilling. I mean, all we really have to do is just replay the same game. Just not do the final trial. That's really it. Yeah. If you want to stop short, you can absolutely just do that. Yep. But yeah, cool thing about this, I, I actually really like how they uh, how they do the credits here. Kind of going across the surface of the planet. So yeah, this is PNF 404. It will not be called that until Pikmin 3, however. And it's meant to be kind of a um, an aged Earth after uh, after humans have gone extinct. Yeah, that that's kind of... You can kind of pick up on that um, in this game, but it becomes a lot more prevalent in the in future installments especially pikmin 3 and pikmin 4 well um, pikmin 4 especially because you're in a house yeah there is an entire level dedicated to being in a house i forget what that level's called is it like the giants is it giants no giants hearth is a is a that's the the picnic in like garden oh, area yeah, you're right that's the one after um I, I don't remember what it's called but yeah it's the fourth area of the game and it's there are so many great places in Pikmin 4. I think my favorite episode, uh, my favorite episode, um, my favorite thing about Pikmin 4 probably has got to be uh, either the third area, I don't remember what it's called, um, or the, uh, is it the Blooming Arcadia that's the second episode, uh, the second level, or the Blossoming Arcadia? I think it's the Blossoming Arcadia. That sounds right. But yeah, enough about Pikmin 4, let's talk about Pikmin 1. What was your favorite thing that happened in the series? Be positive, guy, I guess. We're done. <laughs> no, seriously, what was your favorite moment? Uh, Headbanging Pikmin. That was funny. Oh, Heavy Metal Pikmin? Heavy Metal Pikmin. <laughs> that that was a lot of fun. Heck yeah. Character Bray, this is how you know um all the enemy names. Armored Candy Beetle. I'm not going to read descriptions. Don't skip it. I can't fast forward. I can't fast forward. Beating long legs, best boss in the entire game. I don't know why I like this boss so much. I just really do. <laughs> it looks like, well, a daddy long legs. Uh huh. But it's beady long. Bread legs. bug. Bread bug. Wee. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's a thick hide. I think it's just a, a like a jelly hide. Gelatinous hide. Forget, forgot, forget Dr. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. It's gelatinous Hyde. Thank you very gelatinous much. Gelatinous Hyde, yeah. <laughs> Furring Sagret. Candy Pop Hyde. Not an enemy or a creature. It's just a flower. Well, it kills Pikmin and then reincarnates them, so. Would this be the next step in Pikmin evolution? Yeah, maybe. Uh, I don't know. We never encountered those. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, basically just think of them as uh, as an upgraded version of the Dwarf Bowl Board. But I don't know why we didn't... <laughs> Alright. <laughs> we skipped an enemy somehow. <laughs> Somewhere. 
don't know. Are we and Pikmin are marching on the bottom of our screen. And lo and behold, why you don't want to <laughs> go against Emperor Bulblax <laughs> with your army of Pikmin. Yep. Oh, yeah. Yay. I love the little Pikmin animation hanging out in the bottom left of the screen. I don't know why that yellow is so angry at that blue. <laughs> Fiery blow hog. We'll get other elements of blow hogs as the game progresses. Or the series progresses, rather. Yep. Gulix! Optional boss! Woo. We caused a Pikmin firework with that <laughs> with that boss. Yeah. <laughs> this explosion. Honey Wisp! I don't think we ever took advantage of this, actually. Yeah, they're... Uh, they're uh, I think you have, actually. May maybe I did. I don't remember, but... Yeah, they're basically just uh, just nectar, flying nectar. Iridescent flint beetle, go! The annoying beetle that causes problems for Gaius. Yes, lots <laughs> and lots of problems. Mamuda, actually completely harmless except towards Olimar. <laughs> actually, I don't even know if this actually attacked Olimar. That's what I'm saying. It, it does attack Olimar. It doesn't like Olimar. It loves Pikmin. Probably clam clam. So what makes me really question is like, what were Pikmin doing before Olimar existed? Uh, they weren't. They didn't exist. Remember, their onions were buried in the ground. But that also incentivized that that one point they did exist. Uh huh. Probably. And they were basically drove to the bridge of extinction. Yep. Puffstool, activate Puffman. <laughs> <laughs> Many consider this walking fung fungus a delicacy. Well, yeah, it is a mushroom, so. Is it an edible mushroom, though? It doesn't really. Well, if Stardew Valley has taught us anything, red mushrooms are not are not good for you. <laughs> <laughs> Mario. <laughs> My least favorite enemy. Are you sure about that? Yes, I freaking hate your grubs. What about the uh, Stitch Beetle? What Stitch Beetle? The Iridescent Foot Beetle? No. It'll probably show you. Oh, sheer wigs? No. Sheer wigs are annoying, but they're more manageable than male sheer sheer wigs, sheer grubs, in my opinion. That that's what happens if you if you uh, do the smoky prog wrong. Yep. Yep. That's actually false. Uh, it, a Pikmin has since corrected itself. The smoky prog is its own thing. It is not a pre-evolution. Um. Uh, Mamuda. <laughs> So that has since been retconned. <laughs> Why do the Pikmin in uh, the end credits actually look better than the one in the game? Uh, because it's an animation. As opposed to game clips. Oh, uh, freaking swooping snitch bug. They're annoying, but I hate sheer, sheer grubs more. <laughs> look at those derpy eyes. Water doubles. What would you say your, fav your least favorite enemy in Pikmin is? Uh, Pikmin. Enemy, Gaius. Uh, Pikmin. So, so Puffman? Pikmin. I like Puffman. <laughs> Bullpole! We didn't touch that either. Yeah, it's... It's baby. It's baby Wally. Wally Wog. That's a Wally Wog game! Sure. Just annoying. It's a yellow Wally Wog. Yep, they're the same enemy. They're just different shaped and different colored because they live in different environments. One lives in a cave and one lives in a spring. All right, and that's it. That has been Pikmin. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Happy the end. <laughs> I draw my controller again. <laughs> Happy the end. <laughs> so, what's our next game? Well, we're going to take a break from Nintendo for a little bit on Monday uploads and we're going to be uh we're going to be doing an indie game. Yep, a very popular indie game uh, that a lot of you know. What is that, I mean, you may ask? Me, uh, Don't Starve. Yes, it together. is a game. It is a game. Don't Starve that, uh, Together. That's the name of the song. <laughs> the next well, name of the it would, song. It would, it, would, it would make sense if we're playing together. Uh -huh. But, uh, yeah, I haven't played in several years, so uh, I, I recently picked it back up again, and a lot of it's been different, so it's a... Uh, Learning experience for both of us, because Heron has not played this game. Nope, I've played it once, and it was when you were showing me how to play a game. Yep. So, so this the game doesn't exactly have an end goal. We're just kind of going to end the series when we feel like ending it, because unfortunately, 
over the next couple of months, Gygus is going to be moving and doing other things, and I don't own an Xbox, so we can't, we kind of can't play over the internet. <laughs> yep. Unless I get a PC set up and then Steam, but we'll still lose the world, so. It's fine. Yep, this will be a time-sensitive series, but I uh, hope you guys enjoy, and thank you for watching. Um, we will pick this up with Pikmin 2 eventually. We just don't know when. Yep. With that, I hope you all... I hope you, get, 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 hope you all have an amazing day, and we'll see you in the next game. Have a great day, guys. Deuces.